Here is a test problem for you. I like you to copy the question, pause the video, find the solution and then look into my suggestion. The question here is tangent from external point. Tangents are drawn from the point 0, 3 to the parabola y equals to minus 3x square. Find the coordinates of the points at which these tangents touch the curve. Illustrate your answer with a sketch. Now it is to be noted that at x equals to 0, the value of this on this curve, the point is 0, 0, and this point 0, 3 is outside the parabola, right? It is not on the parabola. And therefore, we can draw two tangents from here. Now we need to find the coordinates of the points at which these tangents touch the curve. So we say let the coordinates of the points be a. If I take x values a, then the y value will be minus 3 a square, right? Minus 3 a square. So let these be the coordinates on the parabola, right? Now if that is the coordinate on the parabola, then what is going to be the slope between the point on the parabola and the given point? So let us say the given point is, so the given point is, let's say given point P is 0, 3. And this point which we are assuming is Q. And we have the point Q on the curve, which is A minus 3 A square. Now what is the slope between the two? That means slope of PQ will do Y2 minus Y1 divided by X2 minus X1. That is minus 3 A square minus 3 divided by A minus 0, right? So that becomes the slope which we can write as, we can take minus 3 common and write this as a square plus 1 divided by a. So that becomes the slope between these two points. We can also find slope using derivative, right? So we have y equals to minus 3x square and the derivative is y dash which is minus 6x. At x equals to a, derivative is going to be minus 6a, right? So that is the derivative at x equals to a. Now, we have slope here, equation 1, and this is equation 2. These are slopes for the same point, a. They should be same, right? So if we equate this, we can find the coordinates of the point. So we'll equate minus 3 a square plus 1 over a with minus 6a and find our answer, right? So we can use this equation. So we'll write here minus 3a square minus 3 over a equals to minus 6a. Now we can cross multiply and find the value of a. So we have minus 3a square minus 3 equals to minus 6a. So what we did here is kind of we, we equated equation 1 equals to equation 2 since both are talking about the same slope, right? Which is equals to mpq and which is equals to y dash. So we are equating them because they are the same slope at the same point. So once we equate that, we can find cross multiply. So we get minus 6a square, right? So we can bring the terms together because 6a square minus 3a square equals to 3, right? So we interchange bringing like terms together. Now, 6a square minus 3a square is 3a square equals to 3 or a square equals to 1 or a equals to plus minus square root of 1 which is plus minus 1. So we get point a as plus minus 1. Do you see that? So the coordinates on the point are, so we can write down now our answer after doing all this. Let me write down our answer now here. Now we know at a equals to plus minus 1 so there are two points. We selected one and we got two values for A, right? So we have A equals to plus 1 and we have A equals to minus 1. So if A is plus 1, then the Y value is, that is, this is A means X value, right? So the coordinates of the points which are A comma minus 3A square, we get one point is 1 comma plus 1 square is also 
1 which is minus 3 and if I write a as minus 1 I get same minus 3 for y value. So these are the two coordinates where the tangent from 0 3 is going to be rather these are the two points where from where so now we have these two points on the parabola and if we join this with the given point it will make a tangent on the curve. Now one part of the question is illustrate your answer with a sketch. I'm really running out of space so what I'll do is I'll just squeeze it in here right. So it seems that the parabola is minus 3x squared so minus 3x squared means the parabola will be like this right and our point is given to us at 3 0 right so 3 0 is somewhere here and we have tangents here so we'll just draw a tangent from the line like that and as you can see it is tangent at these points and these points are plus 1 x value minus 1 x value and the y value is minus 3. So that is the tangent from our point which is 0 3. Okay? So this is the point P which we have taken and that's tentatively taken as Q and we came up with Q dash also. So that is how it can be shown in a sketch. I hope you understand the steps here. First was that we we took a general point on the curve which was a minus 3a squared since the equation is y equals to minus 3x squared and then found slope in two different ways. One, difference of quotient of y values and x values, right? y2 minus y1 divided by x2 minus x, x1 and the second using the derivative. We equated the two, found the value of a and then got the points on the curve. Now as an additional exercise for you, you can find equation of both the tangents, right? So I'll write down for you, that is our answer, right? Right there, these are our points. Find or write equation of both tangents. So try to write down the equation of both the tangents from point P to the curve with and you already know the points. I hope that should be a good exercise for you. Thank you and all the best.